It's been two weeks since my drunken exuberance. Sarah, my ex-fiance, is back to walk over me yet again. When asked about my love life, I mentioned Melissa. Of course, I changed her age to 19. I feel like the proverbial loner, mentioning a girl I've never met. Because you like the career-driven life. I love them, but I wasn't blown away by them. I'm just waiting for like something extra. Mm -hmm. Thanks. I didn't do that. Yes, you did. And that's okay. There's nothing wrong with that. I mean, I think it's possible to love someone or care about them, but not be totally blown away by them. I could be in love with Melissa or something, but I have to see one person to know. But I just think it's impossible to know what your real feelings are without meeting someone in the flesh. How come you don't know something? She doesn't want to meet me. She feels all pressure. I'm sure she does. She's probably just nervous. I kind of called her, called her drunk. She didn't tell us things. What? It's kind of embarrassing. I asked her to marry me. <laughs> Well, no wonder. You scared the poor girl off. Maybe I should just stop talking to her. Tell her I don't want to do the wrong thing and mess her life up. Yeah, right. And then you'll start drinking and you'll call her and all this shit will come out and you won't even remember what you said to her. I don't do that anymore. Uh, yeah. Famous last words, Daniel. I promised to stop. Promise to. You used to call me all the time, though. Never told me that before. Yeah, you used to call me and you said, beg me to live with you and beg me to have sex with you and kiss you and all that stuff. I'm sorry about that. Okay. Well, I guess I'll do what I originally wanted and I'll take her out. No, no. Let's get your terminology right first. You won't be taking her out. You'll be meeting her. You know, those are the little things that freak girls out. Alright. See what happens. Thank you. Fine. Yeah, she does. My husband's probably waiting, but it's been really fun catching up with you. I'm sure we'll see each other around. Since you're here. Mm -hmm. Thank you for that. No problem. I know. Actually, I really do. Yeah, you too. Have a good night.